And I'm back. With more Persona 3 Reload. Took myself a little bit of a break, get some early lunch. And keep on going with videos. The plan here oh, is to get to the next full moon. And to do that, it's going to be a lot of social link stuff. I might go to Tartarus again to deal with some people getting rescued, but by and large, it's just days off. Hmm? Hmm, okay. Bedebe de be bell. Bedebe de be de de be do. that give me oh my god dude that is so nice will prove to be useful. Go on, look around. Creating equipment. So, what will it be? Everything I craft is sure to be useful against the shadows. Give them a go, will you? To make this, you'll need material. So, what will it be? Oh, I want these, man! So, what will it be? So, what will it be? Everything good? Hope to see you soon. Be careful out there. I'll take as long as you need. Seeing you. All right, I need to save that money. But while I'm here, I could buy some of this stuff. Just a little. Uh, we've got some new stuff. Take your time, Browth. You made you sure? Hey, you got everything you need? That's all. Thanks for coming. You 
You're not shouldering a heavy burden all on your own, are you, lad? Hey, would you? Thanks for coming. Thanks for coming. Thanks for coming. Hey, would you? Hey, done already? Okay, that's that's useful. That stuff I need. Grumble, grumble. All right. today and adding an egg to my order. Whew, that hit the spot. You get a lot of bang for your buck here. Man, can't remember the last time I had such a fresh egg. Maybe I should get some for them too. Oh, my siblings. I've got four younger ones. Our apartment's pretty small though, so pack like sardines <laughs> you could say that you wouldn't believe how hot it gets in the summer I never mentioned this but my father died five years ago mm -hmm. we were told his car fell off a cliff I'm not fishing for sympathy or anything I, I just thought you should know It's already this late. The preschool's gonna be letting out soon. See ya. Hello. No. Didn't know he was back. Interesting. That's understandable. Everyone gets worried when you're not feeling well. Ugh, God, dude. Could you, could you not? <clears throat> Alright, let's do it. Meat and eggs are essential for building a healthy body. And there's no better choice than chicken. This should last a while. Let's put it in the freezer. Thanks for always helping out. Let me know when you want some more. Alright. Ten more days. Good morning. No. Oh. Been feeling a lot more like fall since the typhoon passed. Really hope fighting ends before winter comes. Uh -huh. I hope you're right. That's why. <sighs> A lot of people are concerned about stress these days. Believe it or not, cry crying can relieve stress. The tension is washed away with all those tears. Unlike money, there are no benefits to saving up straps. When your life gets rough, just cry it out. By the way, you maybe have found this out already. We sometimes describe difficult situations as headaches, but headaches caused by stress are a real thing. Yes, that's right. Migraines are probably the most talked about of them all. Some people are more prone to getting them due to their personality or habits. There are also tension headaches. They're really nasty too. Tension headaches are when the muscles of your head contract due to overloaded stress. That's why it's important you never bottle your stress up. As somebody that's been trying to meditate at work to cut down on stress, I can, I can attest to this. 
I find myself smiling when I'm not stressed. All right, everyone, settle down. Huh? So, there won't be any more classes this afternoon. What? But that doesn't mean you're free to goof around. It's time to work together and put away the culture festival displays and decorations. I'll assign you into three groups for the cleanup. The first group will go to the science lab. Your leader will be... <laughs> okay, let's hurry up and get this over with. Ow. Roger that. Got it. Hmm, I guess this was the photography club's display. <laughs> Look, we got a pretty good picture of you. Whoa, the guy who took first looks pretty suntan. That's high say. It's crazy fast. Of course, it's only a matter of time until I take him down. <laughs> You've already got him beat in the sweaty department. I swear, I've never seen you without your gym clothes. Are, are okay. we working or are we goofing wrong? One here. Just walking around is enough to work up a sweat these days. Hey, you guys can jabber all you want, but at least keep things moving. At this rate, we'll be here all day. Uh, sorry, Takeba. My bad. Hey, this guy you all worked up. Are you interested in her? Nothing. Jeez. Yo, I brought two of the stuff. The nail puller, tape, and uh If you require a drill, I have one installed. <laughs> um cool. Thanks guys. Wait, hang on. Where's the bubble wrap, Yori? Wrap? Oh right, we gotta pack stuff up. Uh, good call, man. You should go get it. You know where they keep that stuff, right? Well, yeah, but you're the one who forgot to grab it. Oh, are you sure you don't want to go? That place is like a paradise, you know? Some fine chicas there would be just your time. Ouch. Uh, what? No way. You serious? Give me the details, man. I believe I asked you all to hurry it up so we could go home. Yeah. Oh, uh, sorry, Yukatan. Man, talk about an ace directive. I heard that. Jeez, how stupid can you be? Junpei? More like stupid. I'm getting deja vu. Fine, I'll go to the supply room later. Still, it's a real shame the culture festival fell through. There were so many cool events I was looking forward to, like the stand-up comedy duos. They said it was going to be open mic, so I was planning on trying it out. Oh, really? With who? You. Hmm. Wait, me? Are you going to just push me on stage without even saying anything? I'm just messing with you. It was actually Miyamoto. Who, me? Help! Another joke. Chill out, guys. I'll do it with you then. Now that's the spirit. Why don't we show these guys what we've got? Nothing. What are we doing? Hello out there, everyone. We're the famous comedy duo. Ooh, nice and snap again. I can't wait for the culture festival. Given up already? You know what they say. Early to bed. There you go. We got a top quality one this time. Hey, speaking of jokes, here's a good one. What do you do when your key isn't working? Oh. That's the lamest joke I've heard in years. Yes, that's the best Gecko Con has to offer. Hmm. Man, we would have been good. Break it up, you guys. Serious. Speaking of things that would have been great, you missed out on your chance to be a maid, Takebasan. Duh. Huh? Oh, so word got out about that. I, for one, am fine with missing that opportunity. And a lot of guys were real disappointed. Ain't that right, Miyamoto? Huh? Uh, how should I know? Wait, why are they disappointed? The maids are there to help at the cafe, right? Ah, uh, such a pure soul. Oh, 
it's kind of something that guys fantasize about. Mainly Junpei. Yup. Oh. What are you looking at me for? What did I do? Junpei-san. Oh, no. Come on. You too, I chan Oh. Ooh. Getting Igis mad at you takes talent. For screwing up. Ugh. Remember, she has a drill installed. Greetings. That was quite a sizable typhoon. I had expected the school would have sustained some damage. However, I was mistaken. It must have been durably constructed. want to talk to you. I really don't, dude. <sighs> Whatever. I can't eat. You sure you want to know? No. I don't think we're going to get to eat together like this anymore. To be honest, something's been on my mind. I saw a magazine in Emmy Reed's room. Guess what it was called? How'd you guess? Man, you're amazing. When I saw that magazine, it got me thinking. And I've made up my mind, man. As soon as I graduate high school, I'm gonna marry Emmy. You think that's a good plan? <sighs> I'm not rushing things. I'm gonna marry her eventually, so what's the difference? Why should I wait? I'm seriously in love with Emmy, and I'm gonna marry her. Then, Emery Kano will be known as Emery Tomochika, and I will make her the happiest wife ever. You say that. <sighs> Sorry, I just want you to back me up, you know? Uh-huh. This is a terrible idea. This is such a terrible idea, you idiot. We should get going. There's a reason I've been putting this off while... Well, one, because all the stat shit, but come on, dude. It's like, fuck you, dude. Oh, welcome. Mm, I don't know. Don't really have to go. Um. Okay. Maru. He works with him a lot lately. Um, charm, courage, increase the yield. Um, I'm gonna get my academics up. I know I still got a couple of months, but I still want to get that finished. High school? No. Prodigy platter it is. Should I got the big one? I feel stupid. Oh well. Hmm. Works out. No! Not done yet! Ugh! Damn it! 
Raises stuff, let's go. Damn. Get in there. Get in there. It's gonna happen. Finish this one off. 920. Okay, fairly recent. What? Uh, huh? Ugh. Um. Door unlocked in 92 seconds. I guess. My time has improved. Duh. Hmm. Surface body temperature reads 36.2 degrees Celsius. No fever. At this rate. He should make a full recovery by morning. The pillow I prepared in the freezer will not be necessary. Yeah. I cannot stay too long, or Yukari-san will reprimand me again. Hmm. There are still four hours and twelve minutes until sunrise. Hmm. I should be safe as long as I sneak out before morning. I will keep watch over him. For a little longer. I don't know how to feel. It's 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 nice. It's nice, sort of. Um, spe speaking of I guess, um, I suppose I could spend time with her. I don't know what she would be doing, but they said she's available. Reading books. About the Yakuza? Oh dear. Is it called Like a Dragon by any chance? You have my <laughs> Books about the Yakuza. Ah, here it is. In this scene, the main character says, That ass better not crack under pressure. <laughs> Usually, people's asses are already cracked. Yours is as well, right? Uh... Good. That is a relief. If that's the case, then this must be referring to a different ass. <laughs> Currently, this is the only section that I am unclear on, but I suspect that if I continue reading, I will encounter even more confusing phrases. Yeah. If you don't mind, could I ask you to read with me until the end? Um. Thank you very much. With your help, I've been able to update my records with new information. Apparently, this book has a sequel. If it is possible, I would like to read with you again sometime. 
<laughs> Righteous! Alright then. More charm. It's gotten rough. We should head back to our rooms. Or should I say, our turfs. <laughs> Please don't. <sighs> she gets taught so many weird ass things. <laughs> but it's great. Let's get on with today's lesson. Uh oh. Um I was not expecting these ones. Hifumi yo ima imu no yak yokoto machiro God This is math class. Yes. Well, Mr. Mia Miss Miyahara is feeling under the weather, so I'll be filling it. I'll be talking about numerology. Numerology is a type of magic which uses sees the world through a system of numbers. Essentially, its practitioners convert matter into numbers. Numbers have power, so numerologists merely take advantage of that. Some say the first true numerologist was Pythagoras. You may know him from that theorem, but he's also quite famous for practicing magic. His pupils research what is now called Pythagoreanism. They realize that everything that exists in the world corresponds to a number. They consider odd numbers to be masculine and even numbers feminine. They also work towards verify or unifying and verifying the existence of holy and unholy numbers. And the Pythagoreans focus on numbers 1, 2, 3, and 4 because they add up to 10 and represent completion. They considered that these four numbers to be holy numbers, the most important of all. Tetracitus? Tetra I don't know that word. Later on, we build upon a new uh, numerological foundation. Even recently, studies have been performed on the relationship between names and numbers. Let's take a little closer, shall we? Let me teach you a method for interpreting your own names. Me. Be sure to include your middle name, too. Now, convert each letter of your name to a number, and so add the numbers together. If the letter is a two-digit number, like 14 at the first two digits, make a single digit. Keep adding those digits until you come up with a final number between 1 and 9. Upon learning or reflecting on that digit's properties, you can conclude the characteristics of a person in question. Basically, your number represents your general personality. Are you listening? Use a test to see if we're paying attention. Okay. A bit more on numerology and names. Numerology can be used to discern your inner, se your inner self, your public persona, your future, and so on. Convert the vowels in your name to numbers and add them up. That reveals your inner self. Next, do the consonants, and you'll get your display in the public. Using the same method on your birthday will calculate your future. But make sure to use the Christian era dates for this calculation. It's also possible to assess your compatibility with another person using numerology. By adding the digits of your birth date and others, you can... Mm. That is a lot of stuff. Numbers and numbers and stuff. All right, but I need to put, I need to take a break. So I'll call this an episode. Hopefully, I can finish up one more video into the next big full moon. If it takes two, it takes two, but I'm gonna try for one. So we'll see what happens. <laughs>